Hi, so I'm Daniel from Putney Social. I'm here with local artist Callie Latham. How are you finding the art exhibition so far? Good, yeah, it's lovely. It's really nice to interact with the people. Perfect. Yeah, Can you tell me a little bit about this one? Because like people seen it on Twitter and on Facebook and it's a personal favourite. Oh, thank you. So this was a, an illustration I did for an exhibition in Putney Library. Uh, this is Alex, Daniel, nice How you doing, to meet you. Nice to see you, Daniel. So, you're a local lad? Yeah, local lad. Uh, used to live in Putney and now live in Wandsworth. Fantastic. And I come down here and, and do these paintings. Perfect. So, this is Putney Bridge? Yeah, it's Putney Bridge. Um, and I use my spray paint oh, and wow. marker pens. That must be quite an odd combination. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I, um, people kind of look at me and think, what's that guy doing? And then all of a sudden I get my canvas out and start spraying. So I'm here with Helga Huntley at the Putney Art Exhibition down on the embankment. So can you tell me a little bit about this painting, please? Yes, um, years ago I used to go. In, uh, years ago <laughs> I used to go in Bad Over and uh, I got inspired um, seeing all the mowers. And yeah. I'm very interested in the movement, which you, I try to capture in my collage work. You can feel it, yes, they're, like they're just about to go. Yes, so obviously there's a lot of tension up in here, um, as you can see, and uh, it's a mixed media done in um, different layers of material. Yeah. So I'm down here on Putney Art Market, on Putney Embankment with Jennifer, very nice to meet Hello. you. Um, could you tell me a little bit about your inspiration for this piece? Yes, um, recently I've been doing quite a lot of pieces based on memorabilia, things from my past. It might be part of getting old, I don't know. This one, I started off with this rather wonderful uh, postcard, Edwardian postcard of these children on the beach. And then I cut, cut it out, reshaped it and thought, now what goes with it? So we have some sky, we have a piece of vintage fabric, we have a piece of vintage ribbon, some stitch, and that is my little monogram. So I don't sign these, I, on every piece, it, you will find J.H. I'm joined by Sally the Artist. Hello. Hello. Um, you're a regular down at these events, aren't you? I am. Yes. And how are you finding it? It's fantastic. And are you getting much inspiration from Putney itself? Oh yes, yeah. It's great. It's lovely to see the other artists. and The weather's always good. And you're quite productive on Twitter as well, sharing yeah. about it. I keep seeing you talking about Putney. And sharing <laughs> I do Putney my best. Yeah. So what's your Twitter handle? Sally the Artist. Sally the Artist on Twitter to follow Sally's work and her paintings of Putney. I'm, I'm here with Jordana from Leiden and Daughters Furniture Upholstery. If someone's got a nice bit of furniture that they want upholstered, can you do that? We, yeah, no, we do upholstery, we do kind of full services where we'll paint and upholster and guide you. If you know exactly what you want, we'll do that too. And uh, all you can do is get contact. And what's your favourite project you've ever worked on? Favourite? This one. This is this my favourite. Yep, no, this is um, all the best way into this. This is pure horsehair, pure wool. Oh, wow. Um, well, that's that's solid. I've got a 200 year old brain as well. So. I'm here with Jennifer Chaplin. So, have you been here before? I've done one before today and my first stall, I was so amazed. The first time I put my artwork out in the public arena, I sold the painting. Fantastic. So I've been on cloud nine since that day. Fantastic. You were just telling me that this is one of your favourite paintings. This, Can you tell me a little bit about it? Well, it's a peony, but it's an extremely abstract peony. It actually started this way around <laughs> and then it evolved that way around. And there were times when to me it was looking um, like a famous English artist, um, Francis Bacon. Fantastic. And it became that abstract that it started to look like a Francis Bacon. And I'm here with Ashley Jones. Uh, if you could tell me a little bit about your inspiration, Ashley. Okay. They look great. Uh, I'm an artist. I'm based down on, in Chichester on the south coast. And um, do a lot of sketches at West Wittering, the beaches down there. Um, can you tell us a little bit about the works? Uh, yes, of course. So that's made by my partner Matthew Atkins. He's a glassmaker and basically that's one of our best sellers, this one. It's called The Wave in a Box. Um, and the way he makes it is that he hand carves all of his molds and then the glass, we work with clear glass and then he would add glass powders manually. So um, the glass will fuse on the mold and then uh, for about 20 hours. Uh, so yeah, that's how it's made. And then the glass is basically stuck onto the glass of the frame. Fantastic, that's really yes. unusual. Uh, so it's all 
powders that make the colour, is that...? Yes, that's powders, yeah. But the, the work and waste we specialised in is um, making these old moulds, oh, basically, fantastic. and creating this texture on glass. It's been really nice to see different paintings, different furniture, and now, finally, some beautiful glassware at the art, art market. So if you're around Putney on the first Sunday of the month, please come down to Putney Art Market. Thank you very okay, much. Thanks, Daniel. Perfect. <laughs>